Okay, I'm going to give you uh, some advice here on how to find the snipping tool. I think it actually is probably already installed on your computer. It's just a matter of finding it and getting to it, and then making it easier to find later. So, I've got a very small view here of um, uh, Windows 7 on, on my computer in my office. Um, got a bunch of um, applications down here on the taskbar. But what I want you to do when you're working on your laptop, go down there, you'll see the icon for um, Windows Explorer. Go ahead and click on that. Let me change the view here just a little bit. Okay. So that's going to show us different computer options we have available, the different uh, places we can look basically for the snipping tool. And if you don't see this right away, what you'll want to do is go ahead and just click on computer. And that'll come up with those options. What we're going to do is we're going to look in your hard disk drive, your C drive. So we'll double click on that. It's going to open up a number of folders. What you'll want to do is go down here to the Windows folder. And then we'll need to scroll down just a bit here to the System32 folder. And just so you can kind of check off and make sure you're getting to the right place, if you look up here on the top, it'll show that kind of that path, each choice we've made, computer, C, Windows, System32. All right, so now we're in the System32 uh, folder. I'm going to keep scrolling down here. And my scroll bars are kind of way off to the right. So I'm going to kind of drag this down here. We're going to look for a, a file that starts off with the name Snipping Tool. So I'm just going to scan down and scroll down here pretty quickly. Okay, oops, I scrolled down a little too quickly. I'm going to go up a bit. Okay, and you'll see here there is indeed a, a file there, snippingtool.exe, or snipping tool, it'll say. It has a little snipping tool icon on it. And what what may well have happened is that the snippy tool um, uh, basically got uh, taken off of or disconnected from um, your your start menu. Um, so what we're going to do here, looking at the snippy tool, you see, we're going to right click on that. Let's see here now. Oops, take it back to that. Right click on that. There we go. So I got the wrong menu up. I didn't quite right click on it, but I'll just right click on that line. It's going to come up with all of these different options of places, things we can do with that link. What I'm suggesting doing is, um, let's see, oh, and mine is pinned to my start menu. I'm going to start off by unpinning it, so it'll be more like the situation you'll see. I'll right click on that, it'll have this option to pin to start menu. Choose that, and that will then add it over to the start menu. What you then should see, and we'll test this out, I'm going to move our view on down here just a bit. Click on Start Menu, and you'll see it show up then on that on that list. Um, that should also probably make it show up under Accessories. It may not automatically show up under Accessories though. But the main thing is that Pin to Start Menu. So let me go back to that step back there. Um, the main thing of the Pin to Start Menu is that it will come up. Oops, <laughs> I went over that too long. Pin. Go back. It will make it show up here on that list of items uh, on the start menu. So that's why I was just uh, giving it a try. And um, oh, actually, <laughs> I'm telling you it's on the start menu, but weren't able to see that. There we go. So there's the snippy tool up there on the start menu, and that's where again yours should show up as well. So give that a try. Um, if it still doesn't work, let me know, and I'll see what other advice I give in terms of actually downloading the software. But everything I found looking around on the on the um, web. Uh, seems to indicate that that is the problem, that it's probably installed with Windows, but just not showing up there. All right. Again, let me know if you have questions.